Hello, hello, everybody. We are going to continue our Fire Emblem Awakening playthrough right now. Mostly because I really liked what happened last time. Uh, well, the glitches aside. Darn thing. Click the wrong button. Brain goes in dead. But yes, uh, yeah, <laughs> wrong button aside. Uh, and glitches aside from last time, it was a fun time, and luckily the glitches were only minor. The, the, the ever troublesome world of emulation, I suppose. I tried to play around with settings to try and fix it, but it's kind of finicky. I might have done the right thing, but either I, like, finally found the right setting, or it is completely random on startup. And I don't know why. I tried to do some looking into it, but apparently, like, there were some other texture glitches people ran into, but not this. Then again, I, once again, I remember testing this out a long time ago and getting a few hours in, but I forget, like, everything. And there, there, I do not recall a glitch, but we're gonna go ahead and continue on. Oh. That's interesting. I did. I, I just saw the left and right, and it's like switch. What do you mean? Huh? So these are battle saves, and you can have two battle saves. Interesting. But chapter two, on we go. I don't think we have. Nope. Uh, no supports. No supports. No wonder Frederick's been whooping ass. He's a a bee. And spear. But, uh, D's and everything else. Very interesting. But, yep, we shall continue on. Begin the chapter. Begin the chapter. Chapter 2. Shepherds. Commander Shepherd. <laughs> Here we are. The Shepherd's Garrison. Go on, make yourself at home. I wonder how many characters I'll have to do voices for. This is an army game, so maybe lots. Lisa, my treasure, are you all right? I've been on pins and needles. What? Do you fight with an umbrella, lady? Granted, you have more armor. Oh, no, there you are. Huh? Oh, hey, Maribel. Oh, hey, yourself. I sprouted 14 gray hairs fretting over you. You counted them? Ah, <laughs> uh, don't w You'd worry too much. I can handle a battle or two. Even though I think she was the one that got targeted the most <laughs> last time. Although I could do without the bugs and the bear barbecue. Hey, <laughs> hey Squirt. Where's Crumb? I bet he had a rough time out there with that old teach and his trusty axe. Oh, so you're teach now, Vake. Vike? I, uh... A part of me wants to say Vike, because it sounds cool. But it's probably Vake. Vike? Eh. <laughs> oh, so you're teach now, Vake. Is that it? <laughs> and here I thought people were just born lacking wits. It can be taught. Ah, oh, uh, never doubt the Vike. Wait, was that an insult? <sighs> Beg pardon, but when might we see the captain? Yeah, when will we see the captain, actually? Why is he... Oh, yeah, because he had a meeting. I forgot. Poor be... Sumia. She's been simply beside herself with concern. Is, is she who he normally... Is she the person in the thing? Is it doomed? Am I doomed to not have my husband? Oh. Is she the one in the opening that stood beside him in the presumable future? Because, again, Lucina isn't Lucina, she's Marth. Or at least she claims she's Marth, but she's actually Lucina. We had a, a, a premonition of the future. Or did we get sent back in the past? I don't know. Things are weird, man. Things are weird. It just seems interesting that they seem to have, like, Crom on a big castle balcony 
with a lady and a child. And it is wondering, is that what is meant to be canon? But he is my husband. I want him for myself. Her eyes were scanning the horizon all day during training. She might have earned fewer bruises fighting blindfolded. Ah, uh, Sumia, that's so sweet of you to worry about Krom. Worry? Well, I... He's our captain and our prince. Of course I'd worry. So, who is the stranger? Why do you have, like, a weird metal neck brace with chains? Is it to lock you up if you get unruly? No one's stranger than you, Vike. But allow me inter to introduce Neon. She just joined the Shepherds. Crumbs made her our new tactician. You should see all the tricks she's got up her sleeve. Oh, yeah? Can she do this? I can't burp on command, so I cannot provide accurate commentary. Brr. What's that on the ground? I keep seeing it. Everything else is like the same floor texture, but it's hidden behind the text. What is that on the floor? I'm sure I have much to learn in the belching arts, teach. In any case, it's a pleasure to make your acquaintances. What? Uh, Vike, that was abhorrent. Must you base-born oafs pollute even the air with your buffoonery? And Neon, don't encourage him. I'd hoped you were cut from finer cloth. Hmm. Is this why Crom was like, "Oh, I don't see you as a lady last time in the in the support conversation." Then she just walks away. Don't take it to heart, Neon. Maribel warms up to people slowly, <laughs> or burns too quickly. <laughs> but yeah, just give her time. My boy! Captain. What she said. You've returned. I was... I mean, we were so... Ha! Face plant! Why was there paper on the floor? Huh? Sumia, are you alright? Those boots of yours again? No, I mean, yes, I mean... Uh... Hey. Alright, listen. Everyone in the morning will be marching to Regna Ferox. Regna Ferox? Yes. A unified kingdom to Ulysses North, inhabited by barbarians, or so it's said. Hmm. Warriors are what they are, and will need their strength to quell this new menace. Typically, the Exalt would request such aid in person, but given recent events, well, the people might worry should my sister suddenly leave the capital. So the task has been passed to us. Now, this mission is strictly voluntary, so for any... I volunteer. <laughs> Me too. You'll be needing old teach along for such a delicate mission. I'll go as well. Where did you come from? What? I've been here the whole time. No, you have not. You don't even appear on in the world. Kill him? Why do I get the feeling you're like a tiny man in big armor? <laughs> like, I've been here the whole time. What are you, the resident giant ninja? I... I, um... Yes, Sumia? Captain. It's just that I'm not sure I'm quite ready for a proper mission just yet. A proper mission? I wonder what they count as proper mission. So maybe it's just like she's done some small things with the shepherds but hasn't gone on a, a long trudge of a mission. I'd probably just get in the way. Well, you could stay behind the main group, and if a battle is met, just watch and learn. Your choice, of course. But some lessons can only be learned on the battlefield. Huh? Well, if you think it wise, Captain. Hmm. Just stay by me, and you'll be fine. Oh. oh, yes. I mean, yes, sir. I'll do that. And since I'm the tactician, I don't get a choice. Are you ready? Is everyone ready? We have a long march ahead. Wait for me. What he said. Who's stall? Is it because he's stalling? Hmm? Stall? Why am I the last to hear about this expedition to Ferox? What? Huh? Vike was supposed to. Vike, did you forget to tell Stall about our mission? No. The Vike never forgets. I just don't always remember is all. Uh, 
I swear you'd forget your own name if you weren't constantly saying it yourself. Speaking of which, are you sure you remembered your axe this time? Hey. Well, he said. Hey. That was one time. Okay, twice. But training sessions don't count. Anyway, I got it right here. Teach is loaded and ready for action. Glad to have you along, stall old buddy. Come on. That makes one of us. I was in such a hurry, I had to miss breakfast. The, there were muffins and cakes and... Oh, I can tell you all about it while we march. Um, Your name is Stall, right? Hmm. Oh, I'm sorry, Neon. This is Stall, one of our finest. <laughs> Hello, Neon. Muriel told me we had a new shepherd. Uh, Muriel's one of our mages, so she should catch up soon. And suddenly battle! Gods, have the Risen spread this far? Huh? Risen? Right. We needed a name for this new threat, so the Council gave them one. <laughs> Hilarious considering they fall from portals, not rise. Everyone, remember what we're up against. <laughs> yeah, they'll remember me once I drive my axe into their... Wait, my axe? Where's my axe? I had it a second ago! Pike, this is no time for jokes. I'm serious, it's gone, but I just had it! It's gotta be around here somewhere. Keep to the rear, then. The battle is nigh. Route the enemy. All right, listen up. Especially those of you who brought weapons. All weapons have strengths and weaknesses to bear in mind. Lances have an advantage over swords, for example. While swords, best axes. We'll want to work this into our strategy whenever possible. Lance versus sword, sword versus axe. Axe versus lance, yeah. I assume. There it is. Uh, the advantage weapon triangle. Each weapon has a type. Uh, each weapon type has a strength and weakness. Swords beat axes. Axes beat lances. And lances beat swords. So this guy is a sword, so we could send our lance after him. Hmm. Let's see. I assume this guy is going to stay there and guard their thing, but he could also very well come and try to beat us up if we get too close. Luckily, all of them are like here, so we should be able to stall them at the bridge. And, uh, either that is Vike's axe, or it's, a uh, shiny. Now, we just need to decide how we want to do things, because we have Frederick here, Sully, Stall. Oh, he's a sword! Hmm. So what I probably, hmm... Good, because since we've been pairing Virion and Sully just a bit, what I could do is send Virion up here, snipe him, then Sully to attack him. Oh, but he's an axe, and... Hmm. So we, I guess... <laughs> hmm. And considering that I think that's his thing... Or what's... I don't know. Maybe somebody will bring his axe? Hmm. Maybe that'll be a tutorial on its own, where it's just like, ah, you can give other people things if you, like, stop next to them and select items or something. I wonder what raiding is. Hmm. Weaknesses. He's weak to horses. Well, this guy's weak to horses and armored horses. I wonder what his uh, skill is. Outdoor fighter grants hit avoidance while fighting outdoors. Interesting. Hmm. Well, I'm gonna do my normal thing, and I'll. Well, let's see. Oh, it's cool. It even shows you like who you're like uh, most paired with. 
So let's go ahead and blast him with some magic. Oh, oh, that's not good at all. Hmm. So if I stand there, I guess I could send her up just a bit so that she's not in danger, but she might boost my hit. Let's give it a try. Ha-ha! And then we'll send him up to attack. We can do... I oh, won't even kill. Hmm. I doubt we'll get a crit. Oh, let's go. Hit and avoid. Darn it, me. I didn't go in for a blast. I wonder if that can only happen if you're, like, paired to the side. Hmm. And I guess I'll go ahead and try and shoot this guy. Shoot him from the bushes. Except he's in the bushes. And luckily he's not a throwing axe man. Hmm. Oh, I won't even kill. That's the thing. Will he kill? He won't kill either. Hmm, but it would, hmm. Wish I could attack from the side, just so I could, like, get some more bonus. Guess that's what I should do more from now on. Instead of doing it from two tiles away, do it from the side if possible. But then it would have been in danger from... I guess, hmm. I guess I'll send him up just to, like, help him if he gets attacked, which is possible. Well, fine. We're gonna send him up to... An well, actually. Nope, he's too far away. Come up here to annihilate this twink. I probably could have annihilated him just without it. We'll go ahead and try this, even though it probably won't work. Yeah, she'll hit, but he'll... Oh, hey! Virion coming in clutch! Ah, attained a better we weapon level. Then I'll come... Hmm. Yeah, I'll set him here to help, just in case. So more and more people are, like, less in danger. Aha! Double ha! Would have been hilarious if Virion sniped him, too. Oh, hey! Oh, splendid. It seems I've caught up. Now to ex... To... Extirpate these brutes. What the fuck kind of word is that, lady? Is that an axe? Why, yes, it is. Perhaps someone mislaid it. I did not thought such dereliction permissible among the shepherds. Still, I'd be remiss to not return this implement to its owner. Perhaps along with a stern word or two of disapprobation. Trading items. Move next to an ally, select trade. Then choose the items you want to exchange. We are not here to attack, we're here to trade. Yes, him. Send over an axe. Oh, you have a fire. Good. Oh, and then we get to attack. Neat! You won't even kill him. Let's do it. Don't you give up. Don't you give up. <laughs> then he just waddles on over and misses. That's all. What? Oh, my axe. Oh. I wondered what manner of ignoramus would mislay their weapon. Now I know. Thanks. Thanks, Muriel. Er, for the axe, anyway. Perhaps next time I'll use a spell to fasten it to your hands permanently. But then he wouldn't be able to really uh, do things. Go ahead and kill that guy. <laughs> Cheers. Uh, 
Attain thing. A leader must never rest, never surrender. Most of all, never stop learning. 24 experience. Just in case I'll stand by him, because he is husbando. Hmm. I'll go ahead and grab these forts for us. Forza Horizon. Ah, and he can stand up there too. This way, if they try to move up, we have like some stuff going on. And they do move up. Not my axe, man! Axe on axe combat and spear! Good job showing, like, thanks, Vike. And he goes after the boy, too! Assholes! If these guys got a crit... Oh, that would hurt. Move away. Actually... Hmm. Because I kind of want to... I know. Well, actually, I don't think there's much worry up there, but... Wait there. You can then... He's just too far away because the guy's in the way. Lol. I'm trying, my brain is like, like, yeah. Meh, 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 meh. Fine, I'll come help you. I shall kill him. My brain is going on too much about, hmm, how do I, like, uh, get these characters to stand next to each other for bonus? Get in there and heal. And then as a bonus, she can come over here and heal him as well. And that'll get him up and level her up a bit. Move everyone up as a unit. What well, next, Neon? Guide our swords. My lord. Might I advise patience, my lord? Neon is a fine tactician, but we have been working her mercilessly. Even the best of us needs rest. Right. Yes, of course. I'm sorry. Well. Perhaps Neon would prefer we choose our own actions at times. What? But how will we know? How will we know? Uh. We could use a simple command that lets us fight on our own. So long as Neon realizes such a strategy does not guarantee victory. Acting as we see fit may not always lead us to the best course of action. Auto battle. I don't think I'm going to do that. I will micromanage everything. I have been tormented by, by XCOM too much to allow this to happen. Move to an empty space and press the A button to open up the system menu. Select auto to begin auto battle. You can cancel an auto battle in progress by pressing the X button. So I guess it's just like if you want to go crazy. Sure. I'll quickly send her over here to heal Krom as well. We will send our heroes to the front. Level up for the Lisa. She only got two stats. And I don't think any of them help. Hey, look at me go! Getting terrible stats, probably. Actually, I probably should have went up two, so... Actually, no, that wouldn't have worked. Hmm. Move everyone up just a bit. And we shall end. 
Sword versus sword. My boy! Ah, level up for the boy. HP. Oh, that's a lot! That's nice! Hell yeah. I feel a huge difference. And now strike at the enemy! Hell yeah! And level up for the Sully! Who also gets good stats. Turns out the business into my sword is me. Well, you do run the business. Go ahead and smite down that enemy. So maybe you can level up too. Huzzah! He also gets a good stat layout there. I'm not sure if they're like good stats for him, but there are like a good number of stats. Am I not a thing of beauty? Am I not a thing of beauty? Hmm, do we want to kill him? Actually, we should probably kill him with me so I can maybe get some level up. Blast him with some thunder lightning! Ooh, hit and crit. Hell yeah. Level up <laughs> infinity. Ooh, it leveled up my magic. That is what I want. I've been using lots of magic, so it definitely helps. Hmm. Should be careful to move up. We could maybe move some... Oh, no. I would suggest ending here to maybe bring out more. Nope. The issue is... Hmm. Because if we move up too much... Because this is like a lower end difficulty... So if I wanted to, I could maybe run at least to this to bring this guy in. And that would even heal Krom a bit. The issue is that this one would really be in line for striking. I could probably get, like, a decent number to back Sully and Virian up. So let's see. I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to send Sully up here. Virian to be to her side. Stahl will then come up here to reinforce. If he was a bit further along, he could reinforce Virian. Oh, he can't even get there. Darn you. Can I get there? I'm also one short. Even he's short. But then this will allow double aid. Frederick can come up here and grab whatever this is. Hmm, I'd better pick this up, lest someone stumble upon it. Dying Blaze? What the fuck? What is a Dying Blaze? Is it like a Doomsday spell? What the hell? And poor Lisa won't be able to do anything up there. Oh, weird choice? Okay. I. Alright then. Weird choice, but okay. Well, I guess not so much. He does have Weapon Triangle. And now, <laughs> she gets attacked. Get missed, fool, and counterattacked. Double counterattacked. With Lance and Sword. Hmm. 
if I miss, she's dead. Which I guess I could heal her. Come up here and heal! My Just use up my staff. Uh, I don't know how important keeping staffs around is. Burn alive, risen man. I completely forgot about that one guy over there who's in the bottom. I completely forgot that he exists. Hmm, finders keepers. He won't be needing it anymore. Item drops. Items shown in green text in the enemy's inventory will become yours if you can defeat that enemy. Neat, and he'll drop an iron sword. You know what? Smack this boy. Cut his face open with a, a face of his own. Give me that sword. <laughs> We'll move him up so he can heal, just cause, and then I think we'll end there. Just in case. Because I was just outside of his attack range. Hmm. Speaking of attack range, that guy is just, like, out of everything. We'll place that there so we know where to avoid. Let's see. Stall's a nice man. I shall place him here so that I can attack this guy from the side and do minimal damage. Never mind. <laughs> minimal, minimal damage, I say, as he <laughs> becomes almost dead. You can come up here and get some heals. Guess I'll place her there to kind of guard everyone. Double guarding. Hmm, actually, put nah, because that would put her in range, and he'd totally go for her because he's a jerk. Because the bosses don't. Well, this boss doesn't move. You fool! You have picked the worst person to attack. Yay! You saved me, my friend. Alright. What we'll do is a thing. First things first, I'll come in and then I'll attack him. Eh, hey, let's do it. <laughs> Why do you have a stone face? Dodge it! Aha! Get missed! And then I will shoot you with a bow. The boy! Let's see, would that kill him? It might. Hmm. Do I want to give her the opportunity to kill him? Do I want to? What I'll do instead is I will, of course, give it to Krom so they affinity all over the place and smack him in the face of Falcon. Kill this man! Get all the bonuses! And get a crit, apparently, neat! 
I think that would have killed him in one shot if we did that the first time. <laughs> well, I'm not gonna rely on crits. I'm not insane. Stage complete! I wonder what the speed run for this game looks like. The most optimal pathing and abuse of AI. Finally. And good riddance. But if they're appearing this far up the north road, ah. then no path is safe. We'll need to stay wary. We shall overwrite this, I suppose. Well, I can, yeah. And <laughs> I like the kind of silly music that plays. Oh. Well, what do we have here? Huh? Hey, is that what I think it is? What is it? A, a fully armored Pegasus? What? Yeah, it's a Pegasus, all right. I think it's hurt. Excuse me. Bleh. I think it's hurt. Let's just have a look here. Whoa! Down, girl! Easy there! Pardon me. <laughs> Captain, one moment. Where'd you come from? <laughs> you fall on your face again! Sumia, are you alright? Those boots of yours again? No, I mean, yes, I mean, we literally had this dialogue, the last dialogue opportunity. <laughs> well, come no closer. This beast is crazed. It's okay, Captain. I can handle this. Shh. Easy now, girl. I won't hurt you. Why is it fully armored? Do they just not have unarmed... Oh, that's adorable art. No, it is, in it is indeed intended to be armored. Okay. Shh. How did you calm it so quickly? Wow. That's incredible, Sumia. <sighs> I've never seen anything like it. Oh, it's... it's nothing, really. I just have a way with animals, I guess. Good. I should say so. <laughs> Good, the default voice says. Good. <laughs> you all go on ahead. I'll dress her wounds and catch up as soon as we're able. Hmm? We can make time to wait for you. No. Thank you, Captain. <laughs> this is like... No. Uh, the default voices amuse me for some reason. Or like the default response to that line. Because I assume they had to go in and program like on this dialogue change to this character, insert this sound. Like they probably have a whole system built so they could easily insert things like that. It was like for this dialogue, name goes here, portrait here, sound here, text here. And so it's just like they went out of their way to make her say, no, <laughs> that amuses me. But I can manage. Every moment is precious when all of Ulysse is in danger. Thank you. <laughs> right then. Be safe, Sumia. Yes. As you command, sir. <laughs> yes! <laughs> Default noises amuse me. Alrighty then. We have new support, so let's see. Varian and Sully. <laughs> She's doing her best Link impression. Huh? Yeah! Ah, most fortuitous fortune. It is none other than my dearly beloved Sully. You're floating like so like a butterfly. You're stinging so like the bee. Why, it's positively... Uh... You got a point, Ruffles. None save the point of my heart's compass, which strains ever towards Sully. That sounds like a no, so get lost. I'm trying to train here. So cold, I feel a chill coming on. I'll surely catch my death if you don't spare a few warm words, my lady. Come now, all this training for war, all this angry grunting. It's unbecoming of a lady so beauteous. Um. <laughs> a pretty girl can stab a guy as easy as an ugly one. But she still needs to practice, so clear out. No, no doubt the poets would write of your grace in combat. Stabulous, they'd say. Well, there is no need for such exertions. Not when you're a, you have a man to protect you. Hmm? I've yet to see a man up to that task. Milady, you wound me. Such a man stands before you at this very moment. <laughs> Wait, are you talking about you? <laughs> oh, you're a funny guy, Ruffles. I'll give you that. Wait, I wasn't joking. Hell no. Do you have any idea how many people try to kill me on a daily basis? 
I'd take a certified hero just to keep up, let alone protect me. And I vow to be just a hero. Ruffles, I, I'd hire a wet nurse and her kid as protectors before I'd consider you. So it's proof my lady desires it, is it? So be it, I shall gladly furnish such. Watch closely our next battle. I'll display such heroism as makes for legend and song. Oh, this should be good. I kind of like their dynamic. Where she's just like, sure, dude. Go ahead, prove me, <laughs> prove me wrong. Just feels amusing. Well, up we go. To chapter three, the long fort. Yeah, it doesn't look that long to me. Bergen this chapter. Warrior realm. Is it the Amazon with all the Amazons? Uh, Frederick, I'm freebing. Stand beside my horse, milady. She'll shelter you from the wind. Oh. So this is the fortress? Right. Yes, the long fort. It stretches along the border of Elise and Regna Ferox. Ah. The cons that rule Ferox have grown quite wary of foreigners. Still don't mistake a lack of hospitality for open hostility. This simply calls for a bit of diplomacy. <sighs> Negotiation's not my strong suit, but I'll do my best. Remember, everyone, your actions here reflect back upon Ulysses. Either we're going to be saving them from combat, or we're going to be doing combat with them, because it said... I'm pretty sure it said combat. Trouble in the wind, my lord. The Feroxy Guard are mobilizing. What? What? Why? Right. Who can say? But they look ready to let fly at a moment's notice. We best prepare for combat, just to be safe. Perhaps we ought to pool our supplies and select which shepherds to deploy. Loath as I am to trust her, Neon might offer some valuable insight in this. Mm. Indeed, she is our tactician, after all. So, Neon, what do you suggest? Let us see. Preparations unlocked! You select units to decide who, will, who you will take on the battlefield. Choose inventory to manage weapons and items. Once your preparations are complete, choose fight to begin the battle. Alright then. So Muriel is currently out. Hmm. I kind of like our current setup without Muriel. But, uh... Equip skills? Veteran. Grants the unit 50% more experience while paired with another unit. Cool. Miracle. Survive lethal attacks. <laughs> Trigger percent equals luck. Discipline. Oh, discipline doubles the amount of weapon experience the unit receives, so he can train fast. Grants skill plus two, so he's a bit more skillful. This guy is hardy. Discipline. Muriel magic plus two. Neat. Inventory. Muriel. Uh, store that. This guy has an iron sword, but can he even use it? No, we cannot, so we will store that iron sword. Dying Blaze. Fire powerful but quick to break. We shall store that away. Hmm. So Sully is sword and spear. So I guess I'll give you. And there's brand swords everywhere. I will take the additional dying blaze as like a I want this thing to die button. And there was also yeah, that iron lance, because stall, you are lance and sword. So I shall give you a lance. Right again. View map. Ah, Callum's coming along, and we just can't remove him. And these are like our start locations. There's Shiny over there. So we'll need to plot our thing exactly. Hmm, stairs. 
I'm guessing that they're just standable, non-interactable, and these are like... Interesting how the stairs we can actually use. Door key? Door key? Interesting. Rhymey. Raimi. Hmm. You're named. That makes me slightly worried. Like, maybe you're just a boss? <laughs> that reminds me that uh, a YouTuber I watch sometimes, Chugga Conroy, recently tweeted out at some point that apparently, like, there's a fan favorite character. I know, I'll know her from sight, but apparently she starts off as an enemy, and he thought that she was just a boss and one-shot her. Which, oh yeah, if I remember, there's, like, a recruitment in this game series. Yeah, I think if I recall way, way back, that's one thing that stuck with me. Is that apparently some units require special, like, recruitment decisions. So we'll have to experience that. But anyway, let's get on to the fight. Who goes there? <laughs> Not what I expect out of your voice. Halt! Who goes there? In the name of House Ulysses. Ulysses, I seek audience of the cons. Halt. Not another step, my bold lad. I've Lancers at the ready. Hold, milady. We are not your enemy. Exalt Imarin herself sent us to discuss matters of mutual interest. What? My only interest is keeping you out of Regna Ferox, brigand. <laughs> brigand? Now see here! Right. You think you're the first Ulyssians to try and cross our border? I have the authority to fell such imposters where they stand. What? How dare you! You're in the presence of Prince Krom, the Exalt's own blood! Ah, yes, indeed, and I'm the Queen of Valm. You do realize impersonating royalty is a capital offense, yes. Hmm, then perhaps we should settle this the Feroxy way. You claim to be the Prince of Elise? Then prove it on the battlefield. Kill my people! Ugh, Imran won't like this at all. Please, good lady, if you just listen. I've heard quite enough. Attack! Oh, they're throwing spears! Uh, you need a shield, Krom. Oh! Hello, four-second sh foreshadowing? Better hold on tight, Captain. Could get bumpy. Four-second sh foreshadowing. Here's a, a Pegasus. Don't you dare fall for her. She might have a Pegasus, but I've got magic and tactics. Oh, Captain, I'm so relieved I made it in time. That goes double for me, Sumia. And this... Is this the same ornery Pegasus we met on the road? <laughs> oh, she's a sweetheart, isn't she? Once you really get to know her. Good. Well, many thanks to you both. <laughs> I think the Pegasus is blushing. And I think we had all best focus on the situation at hand. Crumb. They're coming! <clears throat> Alright, the Feroxy way it is. Defeat the commander. <sighs> Fila said, F "I forget. I don't I forget how I decided I was going to say her name. We'll probably just flip and flop five million times." Said Pegasi can fly far afield, but they're highly vulnerable to arrows. Don't worry, girl. I'll watch out for archers for both our sakes. Bonus damage. Bows are lethal to Pegasus knights. This effect is known as bonus damage. Many weapons cause bonus damage against certain units, which can help or harm you. The icons next to each weapon name on the touchscreen will keep you appraised. So, Rapier is good against horses and not, uh, armored foes. I guess, yeah, Rapier, Stab. And then Falcon is good against dragons. Oh, boy. And Callum is here. And I can't use him. Hmm. I guess this side will approach from here. So we can probably draw him in if we move, like, Proxy Soldier with Lances. There don't seem to be any Archers immediately, but they are Lances. And I think Axe is good against Lance, so if we move him here and then, like, pair everybody up properly, we should he should be covered. So that's what we'll do.
since this is the lower side, we'll send you. And he's already in attack range of both these guys. So let's see. Oh, Jesus! Oh, because he's an archer. So he's double worrying. I saw the red just go across. I'm like, oh, Jesus! So he's going to hit no matter what. Convoy? What's convoy? What is convoy? Oh, trading. What? No. Oh, because we could draw from the convoy, I guess. It's like, what is convoy? That's probably just be like, hey, if you want, you can, like, grab things from the greater, like, thing anything, I guess. Okay. Understood. You're going to move up and get yourself killed, aren't you? And I'm here to save you. You know what? I'm actually going to send him forward. Uh, yeah, you can also draw blood. Good. Oh, what? Why, why'd you go there to attack? You are a fool. Oh, and he is not, he's not giving us any bonuses. How do I recruit Callum? Does Krom need to be there for him? Ally phase. And he didn't do anything. Hmm. hmm. What is it, Neon? Yeah. I've been thinking about you, how you rode with Sumia earlier. Do our units always have to fight one-on-one? -on -one? Really? Are you suggesting we pair up? That's an interesting thought. I admit I'd resemble a pincushion right now if it weren't for Sumia and her mount. I see. Exactly. By pairing up, units could lend each other uh, added offense and defense. It also might allow quicker soldiers to ferry solar back. Slower units, greater distances. Yes, yes, I'm sure of it. This opens up all sorts of strategic possibilities. We should try it whenever the opportunity presents itself. Pairing up. Move next to an ally and select the pair up to move into the unit's protection. The lead unit receives stat boosts. Choose switch to have units change roles. And let's pair. Again, I wonder what this guy is like just being here. Doing nothing. <laughs> hmm. Hmm, if I came up here and attacked him. Oh! That's that'll be good. Let's let's kill this guy. I don't know why Kellum is here not doing it nothing. I don't know how to activate him. And that guy's just dead. A key. We can use it to open the fortress doors. Keys are specialized to unlock a, a door. You need to... Yeah. To open a locked chest, you need a chest key. However, some classes like thieves don't need keys to open doors and chests. Interesting. Hmm. Apparently that'll do a lot of damage to him. Hope this doesn't, like, end my turn. Okay, cool. Let's kill this guy. Hmm. Spear. Probably should be able to kill him. Right. Die, man. And level up for the boy. We have lots of stats up. Oh, that makes it so that neither of them can do stuff. Oh, well, what's... I almost want to look up why Kellum is here and why I haven't activated him. 
Do I need, like, Krom to stand next to him, or what? Why are you just here? Hmm. I guess I could pair... Well, I guess I'll pair her into him. Then we will strike! Again, the Feroxy Way's murder. Guess I'll pair you with him. Who am I scared of more? A mercenary with an iron sword or an iron lance? Hmm. Your rating's higher, so die. Hey, they got a door key. Let's go and barely not kill this guy, I guess. Yay! Saves the day. And I get a double attack and you oh, oh, triple attack! Hell yeah. That horse is very swooshy. And now you activate. Uh, do they still not see me? Perhaps Krom will talk to me if I wave my hands around. Okay, I guess... Ah, talk! Hmm? Why do I feel like I'm being watched? Don't you see me? <laughs> um, sir? Sir! Right here, sir! <laughs> Who's there? Show yourself! I'm standing right in plain sight, sir. Right here. Huh? Ah! Oh, is that you, Kellum? When did you arrive? What? The same time as you. I've been with you all along. Er, I am still a shepherd, right? It's quite the honor, after all. I hate to lose it. Sometimes I... Forgive me. Of course, Kellum. Forgive me. You're just so quiet. I completely... <laughs> quite all right, sir. Quite all right. I've been told I'm easy to miss. At least the Feroxy didn't find you. I've been calling to you and waving my arms for several minutes. I don't think they've so much as glanced this way. Really? You almost sound disappointed. If you say well, I just... I'm glad you finally saw me. Just try to keep an eye out from now on. Oh, and... We, I guess because we did the talk, we have to... Do one or the other. I'm gonna come in and fuck your day. What? Oh, that those are his shoulder pads? Those are some World of Warcraft level diddly D, dude. From behind, he looks like a freaking humanoid crab. We'll send him ahead. I'd better pick this up, lest someone stumble on it. <laughs> Miniature lads? Why would there be a miniature lads? <laughs> it already feels as though Neon has been a shepherd forever. It's funny how fighting alongside someone speeds friendships along. And the more we fight side by side, the more valuable those friendships become. Support. Support refers to personal relationships between your units. As units grow more attached, they will fight better when next to each other or paired up. Choose support to have units converse and increase their support levels. That's what I've been doing. That, 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 that's what I've been doing.
I'll be careful. Hmm. If I came all the way up here, let's wait and not door just yet. Again, not door just yet. I want to get everyone into position. Would be funny if they could attack through the doors, though. Hmm. Yeah, good. We're going to wait until everybody is into position so we can more efficiently storm the barricades, as it were. And we'll just use the end. Door! And that uses you. Because of course it does. And I think we'll... Hmm. Door as well. And we'll go ahead and end again. Force them to come to us bottleneck style. Probably should have looked at his weapons and changed accordingly. Oh Jesus. Oh, Jesus, these guys are tanky. Not bad, but I've got a hell of a way to go. Luckily, he's up against Frederick, so this guy's probably fucked. Okay, <laughs> one side, utterly scary. This side, annihilated. Hell yeah, he gets good stats. Or at least a good number of them. I must admit, I've outdone myself. Okay, I need to switch. So I can then attack and annihilate this fool with some thunder! Yes! Yes! And I get friendship with everybody. Okay, basically I need to... I'll just activate them. That's what I'll do. We will... Ah, actually... Let's see, does that... Well, ah, wait, we can just see. Let's see, and how far can you go? Ah, that might work out perfectly. We will switch. Actually, wait. What weapon does this guy have? Iron sword. And what's the weapon triangle again? Lance beats sword. Sword beats axe. Axe beats lance. I do believe is how it goes. Switch. He has bronze sword activated. And he'll run up to back them up. And this guy is sword. But we'll let... Uh, Vike have a go. We'll have Varian behind you. Love her there as well. Meet your end, fool! D you can't be Ike! Die! How dare you stand on the stairs, you monster! Couldn't kill him, Vike? Oh, oh no, they're moving. All right, I think. Hmm. Yeah, I think that's what we'll do. We'll take out this guy with Varian. I've never watched that movie. Let's see. Hammer? 
apparently he would definitely miss. Well, let's go ahead and smash this hammer man. Good thing <laughs> hammer is good against horses, so we're sparing the main man. Frederick from death. Aha! You missed your stupid hammer, man. And Vike already leveled up. Good for you. And gets a decent spread of skills. Or, uh, st yeah, skills. Stats. <laughs> the Vike just got a lot Viker. What are you gonna do? Go do some Viking? A missed attack could lead to a deadly encounter. I think I'll just leave you there. We'll let you stay there. If he moves to come up and kill, oh well. Let's see, how do we want to handle this? We can come up here and blast this guy to death. Kill him! And level up for me! A decent spread of stat ups as well. Now that's what I call progress. And the dude is tanky. We'll stab this guy. Get stabbed by a big man. You have the weapon good for killing him, and you can't even do that, you fool. Now kill him! We'll overtake this entire fort and make them love us! Don't kill the girl! Okay, good. I probably should have moved her back. And I got a hammer! Hmm. Let's come up here and see what it is. What's this? Hmm. Don't mind if I do. A ladle? What is that? A lethal joke weapon? And what weapon do you have, actually? Javelin? So there's really nothing to really... But you are weak to horses. Or maybe armored horses. I don't know what the secret is. I don't know the secret sauce! Can I quickly change them by clicking down here? I can, I can just look. We'll move most everyone up. switch so if we need to he can be there I'll move her up then we will come up here switch staff just in case also I feel like I've heard that like horse sound effect a million times Actually, I could probably move her across and pair her with Kellum. That'd be amusing. In fact, I think I might do that. For the funnies! And now we will switch. Wait. Because the boss just sits there. Menacingly! Alright. Hmm. What I'll do is I will... Well, first we need to see the projections. And we're not in the right spot anyway. Because my plan is to have Krom strike from here, maybe. Maybe, but she does have a lot of bonuses going for her. 
So, what if we attacked? She would be fuck. <laughs> How much damage would you do? You would do nothing! It literally says that he would do nothing! Alright, so you will just be stat bonuses, if anything. Uh, a javelin to javelin would do nothing. An iron lance would do hardly anything. <laughs> this amuses me. I guess it's because her weakness is armored man. Armored horse man. Alright, so again, end. Because boss doesn't move. Alright, since... Well, let's see. If we moved, switched... Oh, because, yeah, you can't attack there. Me dumb. Let's just see. Let's go through possibilities. You would do hardly anything. At the very least, you will... Go here to add... Bonus... What would we do? Magic would do a bit. What about Dying Blaze? Dying Blaze would annihilate you, but so can my boy Frederick. So I don't really use... I don't, I don't think I'm scared of you. I will place him here. Hmm. All right, what I'll do is I will set everyone... Like, what if we switched and attacked? Rapier would do bonus damage. Let's go for it, I guess. I want to see what happens. And then Frederick can finish her off. Let our battle sound out the truth of your words. That's not how any of this works, lady. Hit, crit, ev evade, everything. That's not how you use a rapier. Ah, that worked. Then your claims were true. Maybe I should have used Frederick to smite her so that he could level up more. You beat our ass in battle, therefore you're real. Forgive me. A thousand apologies, Prince Krom. I truly took you for a brigand imposters. But no frauds could ever wage a battle as you just have. I will send word of your arrival to the capital and escort you there personally. Good. That would be most appreciated. Thank you. Again, those shoulder pads. Amazing. Her whole, de her whole demeanor changed. Right. If Fire Emblem Awakening was a harem anime featuring Prince Krom... In Ferox, in Ferox, strength speaks louder than words. I should have known better than to overestimate the value of diplomacy here. Right. So, can we get going, Krom? Hmm. Yes, it's not getting any warmer. We will save chapter by chapter. What? What opened up down there? Wireless features unlocked, which are useless to me. You're useless to me! And what's down there? Heal, vulnerary, strength tonic, defense tonic, reeking box. We can shop now? Well, first things first. Sully and Stahl. Interesting. I guess they work together a lot. Thanks for training with me today. That was a great session. Hell no. <laughs> Did you just say hell no? <laughs> ah, giving up so soon? What a wimp. Huh? Uh, what? what How can you call yourself a knight if you crap out so soon? The legendary knights who served Marth would never give up so easily. You mean Cain and Abel? The bull and the panther from the old stories? Yeah. That's the kind of strength we need to win this war. And it's the kind of strength I aspire to. Well, sure. I mean, we wouldn't want to be a hero of leg. 
I mean, who wouldn't want to be a hero of legend and song? I just don't think I have it in me. I'm more of a mellow type. Ha! Ah, then take that attitude over to the kitchen, you damn scullery maid. I plan to run circles around those rusty old legends. <laughs> You're something else. But perhaps I could stand to be a little more forceful in my training. <laughs> damn right. I won't stop until I'm built like the bull. <laughs> I'm sure you'll... Wait. You're the bull in this scenario? You got a problem with that? No, 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 that's just fine. I guess that makes me the panther, huh? Yeesh, I've got my work cut out for me. I like their dynamic too, so far. And once more, to level B. Hey. Will things be awkward like last time? We will wait and see. Hey, Neon, Neon, are you in here? Neon! Hello! I have a question about our next move! Oh. Crom? Is that you or... If you could just wait outside, I'll be just a moment. Hmm? What? Come on in? God, why is it so steamy in here? Did someone leave? <laughs> of course. Of course we had to do this. This really is... Fire Emblem as a harem anime featuring Prince Crom, huh? Ah, oh, there you are. I can hardly see a thing through all this blasted steam. Crom, you are a you are a brainless twit in this, aren't you? Anyway, I wanted to consult you about on tomorrow's march. You see, how did he say? How did he hear? I'll be out in just a minute to be come on in. And why is he like? Why is with all that steam in here and just completely brainless? Huh? Uh, is there a special reason you aren't wearing any clothing, Crom? Rather than just stand there like a slack-jawed village idiot. Perhaps you could wait outside like I asked! No. But I... you... <laughs> no! <laughs> Just the sheer horror in that voice line. But I... you... Oh god, I'm so sorry, I didn't mean to, but to say... OUT! <laughs> right, absolutely. Straight away, I'll uh, wait outside the tent. Alright, you. What sort of idiot blunders straight into the women's bathing tent? I'm sorry, very, very sorry. I misheard you, I swear it. I had no intention of peeping. Ah, just fine. Apology accepted. Now, what's so damned important? Hmm. Oh, uh, I was hoping you could offer some advice on tomorrow's route. Um. Fine, what are the options? Hmm. Well, according to this map, one route is this steep trail through the hills. Or we could circle the hills and follow the main road across the plain. I imagine either would work, but wanted to see if you had a preference. Yeah. Hmm, I'd say the path through the hills. The main road would be easier, but we'd be more exposed if we encountered foes. Hmm. Right, that's what I was thinking. Thanks for the advice. Uh, yes, well, that's it, I guess. So, yes, bye. Yeah. Goodbye. Hmm. And Leon, I'm really sorry about the bath thing. I honestly didn't mean to catch you like that. <sighs> it's fine. Wonder water under the bridge. Let's forget about it and move on. Forgive uh, me. Right, yes, good idea. So, I'll catch you later. Er, no, I mean, I'll see you later. Uh, no! I mean, goodbye! Who knew that making a jackass out of yourself would raise your pr proficiency with another person? Utter silliness. Utter silly, 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 silly. But we can buy things now. Let us shop, I guess. What can I fix you with? <laughs> what can I fix you with? Forge? Whose weapon needs forging? So we can't forge the falcon. But what does forge even do? You can raise their diddly d if you have a lot of money. Interesting. So like there's might, there's crit chance. That seems like a specialty thing. That's interesting. You can if you can forge books, my guy. You can forge books. So if I want to turn this into even big bigger of a nuke, I can. And it's honestly not that expensive. And then there's the fucking ladle. Why is there a ladle? 
Do we sell the ladle? It's not worth even all that much selling. Can we sell Falcon? We cannot sell Falcon. But the Raper is actually pretty expensive. What's an elixir? Fully restores HP. Neat. Let's see. A heal pole. Yeah, just like a, a staff. Vulnery strength tonic. Defense tonic. Reeking box. Calls risen to the world map. So if you just want to do a battle. Neat. Very interesting. But there was a thing that popped up down here. What's this? Paralog? What's a paralog? I'm gonna quickly search when to do paralog, I guess, maybe. Let's see. Awakening. When to do... When to do paralogs. Yeah, when do I play the paralogs? Tell me, Reddit. You're under no pressure to do the paralogs immediately. Hmm. You can take your time with them. Some of them have high-leveled sets. Some have low-leveled sets. Take your time. Interesting. I guess I could save and see what it's like. I have no idea what this is. Plus, it popped up super early, so... Oh, hey! We, there's things we can buy here, too. A bunch of bronze weaponry that's relatively cheap that if we need to, we can do. There's even a shop here in, in the forest. Interesting. Well, I'm going to save again, because paranoia. And then I guess we'll try out this paralogue, and if it's bad, we'll restart. And risk <laughs> sickle to the sword. What even is this? Oh. Donal, who are you? Help! You gots to help us! I'm begging you, my lords! Slow down. What happened? Oi! There's the wee piglet! Great. Bandits. What? <laughs> What's this? A little lordling come over to watch over his chattel? <laughs> oh, damn me! Shepherds! That's right. So what'll it be? Run and live? Or fight and die? <laughs> Listen. Quickly, lad. What happened here? Yes, my lord. Right away, my lord. Uh, if it pleases your greatness. Gra oh, <laughs> your greatness. Your graceness. What is this par- I'm assuming paralogs are just like side story things. So like, I wonder like how they would even affect like the thing of the things. I wonder, I wonder, I wonder, I wonder. Because it's just like, and also, what even is paralog? Like, as a word? Because there's like prologue. What's para? Like, parallel? Is that what it is? I do not know. I do not know. But brain is just hooked on this for some reason. Maybe just hold off on titles for now. What's your name? Donny, uh, <laughs> uh, that is Donald, your majestiful. <laughs> majestiful? You are a silly little man, hmm? Isn't it? Who even are you? Why do you have a bucket on your head? I live in the village just beyond, sir. <sighs> I guess that'll do. Now what happened? <sighs> That rotten toothed pig stinking bandit you just ran off attacked us. We got that. <laughs> he was hunting you. So it just kind of makes things go crazy. Uh, pardon my language, your lordliness. 
I'm the only one that got away, and even then just barely. They were rounding up the others to haul them off to a bandit camp. Please, sir, you've got to save them, folks. My ma's one of them, man. She's all I've got in this world. Please, your royal highness. God, this blasted war seems to spawn more evils by the day. All right, Donnie, we'll save your ma. Can you lead us to her? Hi. Oh, thank you, my lord. Thank you. Just follow me, your sirness. Your sirness. Isn't this the same guy we killed back in chapter one? Oh no, that's not even that. The, the prologue. The tutorial. I know, no, it's just like reusing assets, but still amuses me. There's just this one guy who keeps crawling away to cause trouble. And you're sure of this? Right. On the grave of Miss Sainted Mother, I swear it. What's with that? Why are you licking your cheek? What? I assume that's what it is, or you just have a very weird mouth. It was Chrome and his shepherds, and no mistake. <laughs> a fancy lord will fetch a high ransom from noble folk. We'll have a little man squealing for mercy in no time. Oh. We got nothing left to take, sirs. Please let our children go. What? Quit your bleeding. What? Oi, Roddick, I think this cow's the mum of the brat that what ran away. Say. I know this one. You're the wife of the man that broke my rib last time we were here. Oh. And you killed him for it, monster. I wish he'd done for you first. <laughs> Small wonder the brat's got more brass than brains if you're his mum. Guess we'll see for ourselves when we catch him, eh? Maybe we'll even make you watch as we got him. <laughs> God, so no, God. please. He's just a boy. God, this is dark. This here's where they're taking up camp, your lordshipness. Good. All right. Thanks, Donnie. Stay close now. Huh? Beg pardon, my lord. You don't mean... I, I can't fight, sir. I ain't never been st even stuck a pig before. Uh, oh, um... sorry. I just assumed... I mean... Look, just stay here. You'll be fine. I wish I was strong as, sir as you, sirs and madams. Kick that scum out single-handed, I would. Right. When you should fight and grow stronger. But I ain't. No man is born a warrior, Donnie. And farm work makes for fine training. A sickle's not far from a sword, after all. Bandits may be tougher than wheat, but the principle's the same. Uh, uh, all right, my lord. I can fight too. That old seven twang. As you say, I'm no warrior, but these are my people. I got to do what I can. Who even is this Donnie? They gave him custom art, so... Would they make... Well, I guess they... It depends. The mother sprite could be a generic villager as well. I don't know. I don't know. Everyone in place? Ready. Go. All right, so... Hmm. I could bring... I think this is a good overall setup. Let's go. All right. <laughs> All right. Fight and get stronger, he says. Guess it can't hurt to try. I sure hope I don't get in the way. Gosh, that would be just awful. If Donnie levels up in this chapter, he will join the shepherds! If he fails to grow, it's back to the farm for him when the battle ends. Okay. Get that kid some killing blows. We will pair you guys together. Let's see, can you kill this man? He would annihilate you, so we need to get him low. I guess first things first, we can... Hmm. So I don't think there's a time limit here, but there's a ton of motherfuckers. And two chests. This guy has a chest key. Is there a person with, like, a door key? Or do we just walk up to that door and unlock it? Alright, so... I don't... Would this guy run? I don't know. Alright, door key. Chest key, so... Hmm. Hmm. But yeah.
I'll have them here to kind of guard this section. Because I don't think they'll be running for us. Hmm. Let's see, will he die? We'll really knock him down. Because the thing is, we need to, like, get the kid some experience. Oh, I know. Before we, like, uh... Hmm. Because if he goes in, he'll just annihilate him. Miniature Lance. Hmm. Because he's using a bronze lance. Let's see. Oh, because he's only... Hmm. Pa, pa, pa. What if I smacked him with a sword? That would do less damage than my magic. Do I want to use Dying Blaze just to level up uh, the boy? <laughs> I guess blast him. Don't get a crit. <laughs> the times we don't want to get a crit. I'll have him be there because maybe we can just like pair up with me. Come on, Donnie. Fuck. Wouldn't kill him. Ah, oh, that would do... But Donnie, do you have the speed? Nope. Hmm. But then he'd counterattack. God damn it, I... Mean... Really, if he gets counter... If he, like, attacks anybody, he'll probably... Counter... Get counter-killed. Hmm. Yeah, because if he attacks anybody, they're probably going to counterattack and kill him. What if I came up here and gave the kid an Iron Lance? Can he use an Iron Lance? No, because it requires a D in Spear, and he's an E. What if we paired up? And then try to smack. But I don't want to send him up there because of the goddamn archer, too. Hmm. Hmm. There's a lot of people to kill. And I don't know how much he'll level up. Like, actually, do you have any skills, kid? What's your skill? Adds 20% to each stat's odds of increasing at level up. That actually sounds pretty good. I want you, Donnie. Hmm. Hmm. Trying to think. Because there's not much I can do. Have him just be here. Ah, we have heals. Booyah. Okay, so he needs three kills. Don't shoot Donnie, you fuck. Dodge. The boy. Luckily, we have heals. Hmm. We moved up. Oh, but that would kill him. Hmm. You have a miniature lance, don't you? You 
use the miniature lands. Which double works. Don't double attack. <laughs> Alright, Donnie, smack him. It won't kill him, God damn it. Maybe Stahl will come in for clutch again. Nope. Oh well. I shall attack with thunder, kill him. And after all of that <laughs> mini lancing. A level up for me. Oh, that hurts! Don't feel much different, no. No, you don't. Well, luckily he should die, but ah. Hmm. But then that guy will come in and mess things up. Idea! Switch. Let's see. Get blasted, ruffian. I hope that the key holders can't run away. Like, that feels like the thing they do. This is the least of my most noble efforts. And then I'll place him here, which, yeah, might hurt, but oh well. He's a dude. Kind of worried that, like, the door guy. Don't tell me that the door guy. Like, where is the door guy? Ah, oh, the door guy's there. But for some reason, the ruffian thief is moving around, and that weirds me out. I don't like that this guy is moving around for some reason. <laughs> okay, hmm. I guess we'll quickly switch and have stall, like, tank a bit. Go ahead and blast this ruffian, then we'll send Vike in to attack the, the dude. The, the archer man. No partners, but you can smack him. Don't hurt the boy! Only six damage. Again, what is that guy's deal? I almost want to rush in. Just to like... Because that guy's moving and I don't like it. What is he going to do? Lock it? Hmm. Ah, this will be perfect. We switch, and then he can kill the guy. Almost! because uh, I don't think we can, like, switch super fast. Now, what is that ruffian, like, that thief guy doing? Then again, if I, <laughs> to send anybody on a suicide mission, it should be Frederick. Is something going to happen to Frederick? And let me guess, this archer just got in our way. How dare you hit me? Oh, a double hit! A triple hit! So much it lags everything! I don't think that's strategy, I think that's just murder. And we got the door key! 
Don't kill me. Ow. Man, <laughs> triple attacks really just devour this emulator, don't they? Oh, okay, good. No damage. Oh, well, at least I got, like, hmm, that's kind of weird. Very odd. We have the door key. Let's see. Oh, we can't attack through this wall. Good, and I don't think... Oh no, he could get, move there and kill us if he wanted to. So what we're gonna do is we're going to switch, trade, him, it has to be Neon. Switch again. Trade. Door key. Switch again. Wait. And we'll switch so that he's in protection. We shall kill this guy. I hope he, like, I don't have a full inventory or something. Oh! I hope I can steal that from that guy, because that... I have half a mind to reset if a game is gonna jerk me. Oh, you fuck. This is why I do casual. <laughs> I would have lost Vike to a paralog. Ochre's teeth. Not even old Teach can keep fighting in this state. Oh. Do you have it on you? He has it on him. Hello, would you like to die? Let's see. Hmm. If I switch and attack... Oh, yeah, because... Why would it do no damage? Oh, because he's a uh, archer. Krom, don't kill this guy. Wait, actually, come to think of it, shouldn't I just be able to poke him? And that'll get him 10 experience. Booyah! You did it, boy! You got a lot! <laughs> no more holding back! The other's back now! We shall switch, and we shall exchange volley of arrows. And we shall annihilate you. Level up time! A nice assortment. I can huge I feel a huge difference. And this volley will get will kill you. You have committed suicide. He did a jump shot! Cocky little man. You did no damage. You suck! And now you've committed suicide. Give me that, 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 that thing that you stole from me. 
It's mine. Killer Lance, you say? In what way, I wonder? As usual, I'm gonna send these guys over here to get this one. I almost want to give Donnie this because he might earn it, but Donnie, you have uh, done well. And then after this, we'll be able to heal some. Huh? Did someone drop this? A Balmwood Staff! Interesting. And now I don't have to hold back. Prepare to die. Well, actually, next round, I won't be able to heal everyone because he has to open that other chest. And I have to drop something for it. Increases the likelihood of critical hits. I guess I technically don't need the door thing. Oh, the convoy. Yeah, send that to the convoy. It's not a bad thing to lose. And switch. We'll give it to Sully. Snuck in a little extra training. Felt damn good, too. Chest. A rescue? What's a rescue, I wonder? I'll go ahead and put them into mortal peril. Let's do it. Come fight me, fool. You miss, and now you will die. Of course you do. I always have your back. I can tell I've gotten stronger, but only a little bit. Okay, but what is, I wonder... I just want to see. Items. What's a rescue? Moves a distant ally to an adjacent space! That is amazing. That is amazing. That is... That could come in clutch. That could come in very clutch. Uh, I guess switch trade can I not trade between myself okay let's come here trade yes give her the rescue and I guess this just means that we have an extra door key and chest key but yeah that rescue is gonna come in so nice and... Uh, wait. And yeah, now we just have to worry about... Oh no. Not... <laughs> Actually, uh... We'll move as a unit. We'll... I'll switch... So that can be healed. Switch. Heal. So that <laughs> I don't lose the paralogue. We'll move up. We'll switch. I should have moved differently. Oh, well. The guy's a fool. He'll do silly things. We'll move like that. And see how he moves. Pick the right target. Still did damage, but now I should smite you. And sm <laughs> and Krom is just like, how dare you hurt my friend? And charges across the battlefield in an instant. And the archer is just like, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god.
do that so that we can then come in and heal again because reasons. Definite reasons. And level up reasons. Before I get myself killed, we'll mark him. And like all bosses, he don't move. We will switch and wait. He has no weaknesses, but he uses axes. And spear, sword, axe. Sword beats axe, so... Prime everyone's positions. Switch. <laughs> Don't get into danger. If he could just move just a little bit. We will not attack because you would actually not die. Hmm. Alright, plan. We will move him here so he can get some affinity up and... Uh, he doesn't even have a throwing axe? Kill this stupid bitch. Time to... Time then, Castle Whelps learn what us wild-born men can do. Still kind of fits because... Virion is claimed to be of noble descent. Am I not a thing of beauty? I thought this guy was going to be scary, but no. Fuck, he might be a little bit scary. <laughs> Alright, what if we switch and I attack him with magic? Oh, a crit! Crit magic! God! <laughs> This ain't... where... I'm just power leveling myself now. Now that's what I call progress. Everyone else is getting so much more stats than me. I guess I could make sense to a degree. I've done it. We did it! We're rid of them, bandits, for good and all! Yes. A worthy first victory, Donnie. Fought well. Yeah. Ma! Oh, it's me! Oh, Donnie, thank goodness you're safe. I was worried near to death, boy. I can't thank you enough for saving my son in our village, my lord. Donnie, where are your manners? Take a knee and thank his lordliness. Uh, I can't begin to repay all that you've done for us, sir. Thank you. No. We led the charge, Donnie. Yeah, you led the charge, Donnie. We just picked off the stragglers. Hone your potential and use it to keep this village safe. Wait, please. Something wrong? I has a request, sir. If it pleases your gracelessness, grace, <laughs> gracelessness, your graceliness, take me with you, my lord. Let me be a shepherd like you. I'm a, I'm good with livestock, I am. Please, sir. What? Hush now, you fool boy. I, I want to hold my whatever he said. I want to keep this place safe. I never thought I was good for nothing more than shoveling dirt. But my lord, show me there's more I can do. More I needs to be doing. God, help us. <laughs> Isn't that the same line she said when he, the bandit guy threatened to kill Donnie right in front of her? He's like, God, help us. You need to know in your place, boy. A farm man's no fit for a loyal, with royal. Actually, we'd be thrilled to have him. The shepherds need every good man we can find. And your son fought bravely. You're so very kind to say as much, your lordshipness, but... Uh, well, you're a grown man now, Donnie. I suppose you can make up your own mind. Aw, oh, Ma. Safe. You just come home safe, love. I'll see the village is still standing when you return a hero. Well, off with you then. Glory's waiting, boy. Yeah. I ain't fighting for glory, Ma. I'm fighting for you. 
I ain't fighting for glory, Ma. I'm fighting for my friends. But if I do find some glory, I'll be sure to bring it home for you. Oh. Just come home alive, Donnie. Well then. That was interesting. And now we can shop here and get iron! Except uh, we need to like level up some people's uh, stuff before we can actually use use some of that. Yeah. But yeah, ah, some support. Well, out of Stahl and Donald. Neat. Mm -hmm. Ah, pig plop. This is all mumbo jumbo to me. <laughs> Are you trying to read that magic scroll? Good gods, Donnie. Here now, take a break and have a soothing cup of nettle tea. It's a little bitter, but it'll settle your nerves if you keep it down. <sighs> oh, thank you kindly, Star. Hmm. Think nothing of it. And once you're calm, then start thinking about what kind of soldier you want to be. Huh? How'd you know that's what I was doing? I ain't said nothing about it to you. Nah. This morning, you were picking locks, then you were practicing archery. Now I find you attempting to decipher a scroll to smite thine enemies with fire. Either you're incredibly bored, or you aren't satisfied with your current role. Huh? Well, I suppose the cat's out of the bag now. Hey, Stahl, you're pretty clever. What do you, uh, what do you reckon I should do? Well, I don't know anything about tomes or magic stabs, but I'm a keen student of weapons, especially sharp ones. You should do what I did and watch the experienced cell swords and knights. And then I could learn what weapon might work best for me. Gosh, that's a dilly of an idea. Well, remember, if it's not just, it's not enough to just pick a weapon you like, you need training and... Did he just leave? Good heavens, he's an eager one, isn't he? Donald, Donnie, you are a beloved man, aren't you? Well, that's interesting. Paralogs, huh? And then over here is... Arena Ferox, Chapter 4. And then the North Road changed to Magic Tomes? Or was it always Magic Tomes? No, it was like... Oh, because... That's it. Because you can't... Oh, actually, I don't know. Because I, I don't know. Wind, Thunder, Fire, Flux? Let's see. Out here in this wherever the hell. Flux. I can't buy it? Or I can buy it, but it's like... Dark magic. So wind has low might. Huh. Hmm. One second, I need to manage my inventory first. Inventory. I shall store. Let's see. Rescue we're keeping on you. Iron sword on Sully. Oh, no. We need a bronze sword for Sully. Let's move that out. Store. We'll... Hmm. We'll move these keys for now. And we'll keep this Lance because he's our master Lance guy. And plus, the silver one's about to die. Iron Lance, like, hmm. Since, uh, I th actually... Yeah, he... He should be able to use the Iron Lance now, actually. I thought he couldn't before. What? Well, I'm losing my mind. Because weapon levels, Spear E. This requires D, and he's been using nothing but swords. That's it. Okay, yeah. Just had to write my brain a little bit. We'll put that away. We need to level up your magic. Oh, maybe that's it. Maybe I need a higher level magic. Iron axe. And she has the hammer. But uh, it's like a, an axe type. Of which... Since he has the killer lance and the silver lance, but... I don't know. Might 13. Might, I think first thing first. Take this iron lance... So that you can stop using your best weaponry to death. But then I guess I'll give Vike the, the 
the hammer? Give him something to use against other enemies. And now we'll come here. What can I fix you with? What can I fix you with? Hmm. I wonder what... Oh. Hmm. I wonder what that, like, equip means. Down one, down two. Oh, be... Ah, it's talking about might. I think. The might change. I suppose. I don't really care about wind magic. Actually, it might be good to have wind magic on us to fight against Pegasus. Maybe. I'll buy some. Let's take a look. That'll fill up my inventory. But I suppose I can take it and... Like, at least have it. Now we're gonna come down... Hmm. Because we can buy iron now. If we really need to. I carry only the finest. I carry only the dome. So I think Falcon and Rapier will do good for you. He has an iron lance... I kind of wish that it would show you, like, the character's proficiencies. Okay, let's quickly go inventory. Let's see. Lisa is good with stabs. Oh, yeah, and I need to... Balmwood. Restores allies HP used to heal the wielder. Hmm, so it can be used either way. And it seems to be... Uh, no, not trade. I thought I could just, like, put it there, but no. We'll store it. Quickly come over here, where we will take the Balmwood Staff. Come over here. I don't know. It was like, was it good of me to buy the darkness? We will store that for now, just in case. Frederick is proficient with... All, well, can be proficient with everything. Right now, he is a spear jockey. She can use swords, but she needs a bronze sword. So we'll go ahead. Well, actually, we should probably... Because he can only do axes. This guy needs a bronze spear. She needs a bronze sword. Everyone else seems to be good. All right, so bronze spear for Stahl and bronze sword for Sully. And this one guy is everywhere. Sully gets a... I guess that's saying, no, you can't use it. Bronze sword for Sully. Bronze lance for Stahl. Is there anything that I care to sell? Miniature lance actually... Came in clutch a little bit. I don't think there's anything else to really sell, so. I have no idea how important that all is. But I do believe... Hmm. I wish there was just, like, a constant, like, free battle you could do. I guess that's kind of what the reeking box is. Well, let's survey. We're actually making progress across this world, maybe. Where we only see this one continent, so I wonder how far we're going to go. I wonder how many chapters this game is, actually. I am unaware. But, I do believe that that will be it for now. We've been going for about two hours. We did a decent number of things. Things are going good. This is very fun. And there was no glitches this time. Huzzah. 
yes, I do believe that that will be it. And then we also, like, ran into the paralogue. I'm just like, what is this paralogue? What is it? What does it do? And then it's just like, here, have a child. You can keep him if you level him up. So is he just going to be a, a farm boy, just hang out with us shepherds for eternity? That's kind of amusing. But I do believe that that shall be it for now. Thank you very much for watching, everybody. If you want more from me, I have two YouTube channels. One is the edited content YouTube channel that I swear content is coming to someday. <laughs> it is Neon Icy Wings, and like I said, I will post content there eventually, hopefully before the end of the year, but brain. Then I also have the gaming YouTube channel where I stream to and upload VODs afterwards. So if you want to see the streams of ages past, like my Tunic playthrough, Mass Effect Trilogy playthrough, Kirby and the Forgotten Land, Undertale, Pokemon Yellow, Crystal, and Emerald, all of them are there. And if you prefer to watch live streams on YouTube, it is Neon Icy Games. So you can find all that and more. And if you prefer to watch on Twitch, it is twitch.tv slash neonicywings. So long as Twitch doesn't implode for a moment, for a while there, and I think even still, they're doing some wonky changes from time to time. I only ever hear it if it blows up and people hate it. So I don't know. It's Twitch. They do, they do weird idea stuff. Then if you want other things from me, like art, like my little guy in the corner, you can follow me on various social medias. So many social medias. All of them are links in my link tree, which is linktr.ee slash neonicywings. There are sites like Twitter, Tumblr, Newgrounds, DeviantArt, Inkblot, Pillowfort. So many sites that I am using and trying to post to. Also Blue Sky, that's new. I need to I need to double check if it's actually linked to my link tree. Yeah. But other such things in my link tree are also links to my writing. If you'd like to see what I have written, it is fun times writing things. And then also link to my Patreon there for the occasional person that's like, here, have pity dollars. Survive the evils of this world, Catman. But yes, thank you very much for watching and I hope to see you dudes next time. Bye. Bye.